What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Hey, what's going on, people? You know who it is. It's Mr. Swagger 3.0. Reloaded as always. I'm back to give you another video. You heard the intro. I'm gonna, let's gonna go in today. I'm just gonna talk about it. This, this is no news or nothing. This is more or less of shocking events about how how people really take your your opinion to heart on YouTube. And I come to find out that uh, while you like that, that the sun just shifted a little bit. I'm in my other room here, so. And people really take your, your your videos to heart. Like I get on my, I do my little thing. I say my little stupid stuff on you know YouTube and Facebook, and I'm like, hey, it's today. Not thinking anybody's gonna read it, but what they do is they listen, and somehow it moves them to either write a nasty gram to me or to write an encouraging comment. Now I get a lot of nasty grams as you can see, but uh, the problem is I I, can't, I gotta ignore it. I mean, I'll, I'll read you, I mean, if you have a violent point, I'll write back, and I have done this to people. I mean, I don't reconsider my opinion. I, I told y'all that. I don't reconsider. If I say something, what you don't hear is because I say it with conviction. Because my words mean more to me than, you know, it's just the power of the pen, and sometimes it's mightier than the sword, as I find it out on there. And uh, what gets me is just people who are literally to the point they're, they're they get frustrated with the words I'm saying. I've had death threats. I've had all sorts of any, from death threats on, you know. And I'm like, really? It's over a YouTube video? I mean, you gotta be a wacko, first of all, to do this. I had one guy, which I know who it was. He wanted me to, he wanted to pay five grand so he could punch me. But I had to, like, first of all, I wasn't gonna go for it, because number one, there's no guarantee money in a situation. Now, if you're willing to pay me 10 to 20 grand and it's guaranteed money, I'll let you. I'll let you have a chance to swing on me. Yeah, but after that, your first hit was twenty grand. After that, the rest are free. And that's the deal I made of this dude. This dude was talking. I mean, it was on my one video. He probably raised the comments. And dude, this dude, you. I know who he is. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say his name because he's he, he's a peasant. He's nothing. He's a nobody. He's he, he he's a he's a he's a little guy to me. He's a pissant. You know, he's a surf. He's all that. I, I just I'm just not worried about this. this. This guy is he's ten pounds of dog shit in a five pound bag. That's how much I'm not worried about this guy. So it's just people don't understand it's YouTube. And if you may not like my opinion. But I know if you really take it personal, that's because it's, it stings you because it's about you. I'm not talking about you, but you know what I'm saying it is about you. You know what I mean? It's like it's like if somebody says, "Well, uh, you talk." So if somebody told talk, makes a video about people who talk shit. Well, I look at that video and I'm like, "Hold up, man! He talking about me? Now, he don't know me." But I do talk shit. Ask some, ask some women. They not talk shit. What's up, ladies? I talk shit. But if I, he don't know me that I do, but it stings me because it's about me. But he doesn't know me. You know what I mean? It's like he's, it's the truth. I can't, I can't deny that. And that's what a lot of these people are doing. They're trying to deny the truth. So I just, if, if you got something you want to say, say it. Don't don't sit back. You know, don't hold it in. You know, this is a wonderful media to medium to do it. So. No, if you, you damn if you do, a, a closed mouth doesn't get fed. So I'm out of here, deuces.